In this episode of our series of interviews on Azorean gastronomy, we will be visiting an Azorean pineapple plantation, where you can learn a lot about the connection between the pineapple and the Azores. Join us today! Did you know that I'm offering tours to a tea plantation, a banana farm and even to a pineapple plantation? Today let's discuss what we had to know about the Azorean pineapple. My guy today is Tiago. Hello, Tiago. Hello, pleasure. Uh, can you tell us how the pineapple arrived to the Azores? Yes, uh, the pineapple came to the Azores in the 19th century, uh, brought from Brazil, from the Azorean immigrants. Uh, even though the pineapple is actually from Venezuela, but because Brazil and Venezuela are two countries that are close to each other, obviously they share some things together. Uh, but anyway, it was brought to the Azores in the 19th century, uh, first as an ornamental plant, but then later, uh, since 1864, we actually started to take it more seriously as a fruit to be consumed. And so it was in 1864 that we started to use all these techniques in order to produce the pineapple, the Azorian pineapple as we know today, so that uh, it can be uh, consumed. Okay, thank you. And when the pineapples are in season? Uh, well, the pineapple can be caught at any time of the, of the year, but uh, we can say that the best time is the summer, uh, to harvest because the sunlight is stronger so the pineapples will grow in a bigger quantity and also in bigger size. Okay. Can you show us the Yes, of course. Follow me. Tell us three things about the Azorean pineapple that we have to know. Okay, so first it's an organic product, meaning that uh, we don't use any pesticides and herbicides. Uh, so uh, it's grown in a much more natural way without any of those chemicals. Um, it takes about two to two and a half years to grow um, from the root of, uh, up until the mature fruit two to be years. Arf. Yes, two years, two, oh. and a, two and a half years. To, to grow um, and uh, the inside of the greenhouses we keep them at 90% humidity and uh, 30 degrees Celsius so that we can replicate the climate conditions of the country of origin which is Venezuela. Thank you for introducing us to the secret of pineapples no and problem. for giving us a sneak peek where the pineapple magic happens. No problem, it was my pleasure. This, of course, has only been a sneak preview into the world of the Azorean pineapple. If you would like to know more, for example, how you can recognize Azorean pineapples, for which main courses it is used as a side dish on the Azores, what kind of great products can be made from pineapples, etc., join me on my tour. If you enjoyed this video, and don't want to miss out on any further episodes introducing Azorean curiosities, please click on my photo at the end of the video and subscribe to my channel. Hope to see you next time!